Guys, the the utilization of fasting just continues to expand and expand and progress. Um, the latest and greatest, fasting is an incredible prevention tool against cancer and is an excellent therapy for cancer. Um, not only can you utilize it in synergy with chemo and radiation and all the other therapies and modalities, but in and of itself, it is a treatment. And uh, Dr. Seifried has been doing research on this, evidently at Boston College for decades. And what they essentially arrived at was that at the biochemical level, cancer cells cannot utilize ketones as fuel. Yet, cancer needs even more fuel than, than the regular cell does because it's constantly expanding. And so what the recommendation is, essentially, is to arrive at a state of ketosis. And we know how to do that through fasting, right? We just got to work through all that sugar storage in our bodies and start burning fat for fuel. And intermittent fasting can get you there. Now, as a prevention tool, imagine that you're going through this process every day. And what that's doing, I would think, is it's giving every cell that could eventually become cancer or is in the early stages of it, the wrong fuel so that that um, defective cell or tissue dies. If you have cancer, again, robbing those cells of their fuel source, which is typically sugar and glutamine, robbing the fuel of those two fuel sources will allow those cells to die as well. And Dr. Seifert has, has numerous anecdotes and cases of people beating very aggressive cancers, prolonging their lives substantially, way beyond what chemo and radiation would do normally. Or what they find is that the patient no longer needs as much chemo and radiation as they thought initially. So this is just an absolute game changer. And again, goes along with the theme of these first principles and this sacrifice and this tradition and ritual of fasting, which seems so archaic, is actually an incredible portal to health and a prevention tool. It reconnects us with an environment that we used to live in for a very long time. And in the 21st century, we need to recreate that environment through diet and through fasting. And so if ketones as a fuel are healthy for us and make our mitochondria even more efficient and effective for cells that should be there, and at the same time can overwhelm cells that shouldn't and that can't use that, that fuel source, it is an absolute game changer. So fasting is an incredible prevention tool for cancer and treatment modality for cancer. It might be something that you want to share with friend or family um, ongoing. And isn't it amazing that we have a tradition that's been around for a very long time to help us deal with these, with these problems and pathologies that are evidently killing 1,700 Americans every day, um, even with the best technologies?